Hey y'all, it's Alberto at Boston Mobile Homes, and today we're going to talk about Repo Mobile Homes. When mortgage lenders don't receive payment for an extended period of time, they are forced to foreclose on that property and repossess the house. The factory built housing industry is no different. We work with a number of lenders that offer used and repossessed homes for sale on their websites that we broker on their behalf. Many families come to us initially thinking that the used home route will be the most cost effective route for them and their family to purchase a home. In some cases this is true and we can help them find great deals on repossessed homes using these lenders websites. In other cases, when there's events like oil booms in a given area, this may dramatically drive up the price of used home inventory because there's such a large demand. In many markets, at least in present day, we found that a brand new home from the factory can cost the same if not a little bit less than what some of these repossessed homes are going for on these lender websites. Just like any other market, these are subject to change, but there are certain differences between a repossessed home and a new home with regards to warranty and what you can expect on your purchase. Anytime you're buying a used home, whether it be from a bank or a dealer, it's important to keep in mind that the state only requires a 60-day habitability warranty on this purchase. Habitability covers things like water, electric, and the structural integrity of your home, but does not impact any of the cosmetic items in your home that may be important to you and your family. So if you decide that a used or repossessed home is the best route for you and your family, it's important to get any of these cosmetic promises such as paint, carpet repair, or any of those items in writing from the seller before closing on the home and giving them your money. Another big difference between repo homes and new homes built direct from the factory is the way your insurance provider may look at that home purchase. Some insurance providers only cover insurance on homes that were built new and delivered direct to their home site. So you'll want to reach out to your insurance provider and make sure you can get coverage on a home before making such a large purchase. Another major difference is the way lenders may look at your home down the road should you choose to sell it. Many of the government loan programs such as FHA and VA only allow for the purchase of a new home or a home that has never been moved from the initial delivery site. So it's important to keep in mind what your exit plan may look like for this home as your family grows and you look to move into another home down the road. One final difference to keep in mind when deciding which home product is the best for you and your family is the inspection process. When new homes are built at a factory, there is a standard protocol for inspecting these homes throughout the production line to make sure they meet industry requirements. Times when buying a used or repossessed mobile home, you may be buying into someone else's problem. Some of these problems can be covered up with paint or new flooring and you're not always able to see them on the surface. So it's important to have your home thoroughly inspected by a professional in this line of work before making any final purchasing decisions. Just like with any other home purchase, you want to make sure that you get everything you're promised in writing before deciding to move forward with the purchase of a used or repo mobile home. You can certainly find some good deals deals out there, but you want to make sure that a good deal today doesn't end up costing your family more money down the road. For more information, visit our website at www.findmymobilehome.com or give us a call at 210-874-5527. As always, don't be shy with any questions you may have. We look forward to hearing from you. We'll talk to you soon.